Hello everyone and welcome to the video lecture series of mobile application development. Students, in today's lecture we are going to learn about the accelerometer sensor. Hi, this is your instructor Janice Shah. Students, Android supports the various hardware sensors that through which we can monitor the various activities of the Android smartphone devices. Like, see the motion sensors, environmental sensors and the position sensors are there. In this lecture, we are going to learn about the motion sensors which can be uh, repeated. In this session, students, we are going to just list out the different sensors available or supported by your hardware, I can say your Android smartphone device. For this, what I am going to do that, first I just need to take a list of sensors over here. Then, in the below of that, this is the text view, another is there. This text view contains the data, data of what? Data of each and every sensor okay so this is nothing but this is a text view that contains a normal like list of sensors as a data and this text view contains the list of I can say the sensors supported by your Android smartphone hardware device now see so this is a code for the and accelerometer sensor in Android see this is a code where that shows the each and every list of sensors available in your smartphone devices for that this is a private sensor manager is a class sensor manager is object here sensor list and the sensor list uh, set visibility view gone that means first i just need to get the sensor list text view okay and this is a sensor manager and sensor services so you just need to create the object of sensor manager class Sensor manager is equal to sensor manager get system services sensor services list sensor we need to create a list so list of the sensor sensor manager get dot get sensor list sensor dot type underscore all this returns the every sensors available inside the list object now by using the for loop like for i is equal to one i less than list size i plus plus sensor list text view dot set visibility visible first i just make it gone now it is visible now see the sensor list append the list get name get vendor and get version see the sensor is made by which vendor what is the current version of the sensor and what is the name of the sensor all these three things i just get it from the list object and show it to the user now let me just show the code for the same. So here is the very first example for the Android sensors. Students, for that you do not need to write anything extra inside the Android manifest.xml file. Then this is my activity underscore main.xml. Here I have taken the relatively out text view and another text view is here. This text view is a title text view. I am not going to use it. But this is the text view where I am going to use the sensor list data. Now, this is my main activity.java file where sensor manager object is created, sensor list text view is created and bound with the Java and XML object. Set visibility by default is gone. Now, the sensor manager sensor manager get system services sensor underscore service. This creates the sensor manager object. Now, list sense list of the sensors and by creating the get sensor list i can add it inside the list object now for i is equal to one i less than list dot size i plus plus and make it the sensor list text to visible and i'm going to show the name of the sensor vendor of the sensor and version of the sensor all three things inside the particular text view now let me just run the code and show the output so students uh, this is all about the sensor example one so while we're running this particular app let me just show the list of each and every sensors over here see this is the data this is the sensor name this is the company name you can see the first you get the name of the sensor second you get the vendor name and third one you get the version number once again, this is a sensor name, company name and version. Like orientation is there. Qualcomm is the company name and you can say the version is 1. 
Then BMI 220 gyroscope, known wake up Bosch is a company, version is 16777984. So students, we can easily check out the list of the sensors over here. So students, in this lecture, we have seen that how can we get the various sensor list from your smartphone devices. Now, in the next lecture, we are going to learn about the motion sensor in Android. Till that, if you have any doubt in this lecture, then please feel free to ask me. Thank you so much. Thank you.